Howdy folks! If you want to replace your Xbox Series S NVMe drive you need to start by removing the two stickers on the back of the unit and unscrewing the two screws underneath. The first plastic cover can now be easily removed. Unscrew seven more screws. Remove the top plastic cover. Unscrew nine more screws. Turn the console around and remove the metal cover. Gently detach the power supply. Unplug the fan power cable and remove the cooling fan. Unscrew three screws to unplug the side panel. Unscrew one more screw to unplug this little panel. And unscrew three more screws to remove the Wi-Fi card. Next, remove this metal part. And unscrew four last screws. Now you can take out the motherboard and finally reach the NVMe disk drive. Before replacing this you must be sure that your replacement NVMe is compatible with the Xbox Series S. I tried to install one terabyte drive but the console refused to boot. After replacing the NVMe, you will need to create a bootable USB flash disk with offline system update to reinstall the operating system. Check the video description for relevant links. These screws are a pain in the ass, but other than that the process is pretty easy to perform. If you have a tip on how to make one terabyte NVMe drive work with this console, do a mitzvah and write it in the comments section. Stay in school kids.